Who you are to the world is pretty terrifying because what if the world doesn't like you? Love, Simon is directed by Greg Berlanti and starring Nick Robinson, Jennifer Garner, Josh Dumel, Catherine Langford, Alexandra Shipp, Logan Miller, and Jorge Lendenberg Jr. Before I go any further, I just want to say there will not be any plot spoilers in this review. This film is an adaptation of a book of the same name, and it is all about Sam Spare, who is a 17-year-old boy who is harboring a rather big secret. He is harboring the fact that he is gay, and he is very afraid to come out to his friends and his family because he doesn't know how they are going to react. And due to certain circumstances, he has to come forward, and the film is all about him dealing with all of those issues and all the complications that go along with them. Greg Berlanti is someone whom I'm a big fan of. He is someone who has been responsible for a lot of the television shows that I'm currently watching and have watched in the past. He is currently the executive producer on many of the Arrowverse shows that are on the CW. I know him before that because he was an executive producer on one of my favorite television series of all time, and that was Everwood. But he hasn't had as much success on the big screen as he has had on the small screen. But I have to say, this is a big success for him. This was a film that I heard about and I'm actually kind of a like month late on watching. I came out a month ago and I really wanted to see it but I had to wait until it came to a theater a little bit closer to me and when I could have the time to see it. And I have to say I'm very glad I made the time to see it. This is a great film. This film has a lot of heart, a lot of genuineness, and a lot of sincerity and it also features a character that we don't get to see a lot in mainstream cinema. I believe this is one of the first gay teenage characters to lead a mainstream movie, and I'm really surprised to hear that because movies have been around for a very long time, and movies that center around teenagers have been around for a very long time as well. But Nick Robinson plays Sam Spear, and he plays him very well in this movie. He gives a lot of sincerity to his character, because his character has to go through a lot of emotions. He not only has to harbor this secret, but he also has to be someone that everybody knows. He has to have this kind of persona that is also true, but is also not the entire case of who he is as a person. And he is battling with that throughout this entire movie as he is investigating who he is and who this person who has also revealed themselves online on this, I guess, school message board or forum or something like that, who has actually come out of the closet as well, but has done so anonymously. And Sam really wants to find this person because he wants someone to connect to. And when you see a lot of the email correspondence that he has with this anonymous character, you see how genuinely he really really needs someone like him in his life to really embolden him, to give him a lot of courage to come out and to be open with all the people that he cares about and care about him. This film is extremely great when it's dealing with a lot of those issues. Where I feel the film really falters is when it becomes too sentimental, it becomes saccharine, it becomes too over the top, and it becomes very obvious that it is being over the top. And what I also like is the general chemistry between all of the young cast I thought was very good. Sam has a small clique of friends that he's very close with and it's very interesting how the film goes on and how their relationship changes and evolves and it really also shows how real that this type of situation tends to be in real life. There are many young teenagers who struggle with the same thing that Sam is struggling with in this movie, but also if you take what is happening in this movie and you kind of blow it up on a macro level, you see that he's also dealing with a lot of general teenage stuff that a lot of other teenagers deal with as well. Not only uh, gay teenagers, but straight teenagers and whatever type of sexual orientation that they identify with. So with all that being said, I'm going to give this film a 4 out of 5 stars. Stars. This is one of the better films I've seen in the early 2018. It is also a film that is very important. It has great theme work, great young actors in it, as well as adult actors. The film also has a lot of drama and a lot of comedy, and it balances it very well. So I highly recommend checking this movie out. This has been my review of Love, Simon. If you like this video, please check out the other videos on my channel.